Hello Grade 4! This lesson is about text and graphic features. Welcome to our virtual classroom. Hopefully, at the end of this video, you will be able to interpret information presented visually. You will also be able to describe the overall structure of a text. And finally, you will be able to differentiate between text and graphic features. Text features present important parts of the story in a different way. Here are some examples of text features. Bold face text, for example, shows emphasis or indicates a title sometimes. Italic text or italicized words that lean to the right mean that you should pay attention or read with more feeling. Large text may be more important than even smaller text. Punctuation such as ellipses, dashes, and colons can indicate important text will follow. Text in a different color might add interest or fun. Capital letters show importance or indicate a title or heading. Headings name the topic of a section of text. Graphic features, on the other hand, are visuals, such as illustrations, diagrams, maps, and speech bubbles that help explain the ideas in the text. So, boldface words, italicized words, and highlighted text are all text features. Bullets are text features too. Graphics, photos and illustrations are graphic features. Tables and charts are also graphic features. Parts of a book like the index, glossary, table of contents, picture captions, font color and size, these are text features. And finally, maps and graphs are graphic features. Let's see what's the purpose behind using some text features. Title quickly tells the reader what information they will learn about. Table of contents shows students the different chapter or section titles and where they are located. The index directs students where to go in the text to find specific information. Glossary identifies important vocabulary words for students and gives their definitions. Headings or subtitles help the reader identify the main idea for that section of text. Sidebars are set apart from the main text, usually located on the side or bottom of the page. Pictures and captions show an important object or idea. Labeled diagrams allow readers to see detailed depictions of an object from the text with labels that teach the important components. Charts and graphs represent and show data related to or elaborate on something in the main body of text. Maps help a reader locate a place in the world that is related to text. Cutaways and cross sections allow readers to see inside something by dissolving part of a wall or to see all the layers of an object by bisecting it for viewing. Inset photos can show either a faraway view of something or a close-up shot of minute detail. Let's take a look at this text and try to find some text features that have been used. At a first glance, we can spot the title. The title 
is a text feature and it's also written in boldface. We can also spot the title of each section, which is the heading. This section, the information, is presented through bullets. For example, they have listed what you will need, like a notebook, pens and pencils, and so on. You can also spot the italicized words, which is also an example of text feature.